morning and welcome to the Bali Vlogs. We have just boarded the plane. We're in the back row all the way at the end. We do have a window seat but so that's all a bit bonus. We can get some good photos and videos. But it's been smooth sailing so far and we're keen to get there and land and start enjoying our time in Bali. We made it. We survived the streets and the crazy driving. We're in our hotel. Oh, man, man, I am so glad I didn't um, put my hand up to hire a scooter and come through that. Holy shit, that was insane. So we've got that awesome car that you would have seen. It is so extra, but I love it. Uh, Putu is going to be our private driver for a couple of days in each area. He's going to show us around everywhere. And then we're gonna have like kind of off days where we're just relaxing in between. But we've made it. We're in the McEwa. This is our little room. Give you a little quick tour. It's not much, it's just a well, kind of one bedroom apartment kind of deal. Bathroom looks incredible. Have a look at that shower. It's gigantic. Huge. So I'm not very good at that. My battery died again. So, anyway, so we're here for four nights. It only cost us 174 Australian dollars for four nights here, which is absolutely incredible, considering we paid $300 last night for our one little bedroom thing, and we weren't even there for like 12 hours. But anyway, so that's the price difference that I'm talking about. I think it was 1,700,000 rupiah. And at the moment, it's pretty close to 10,000 to the dollar. So it's pretty easy to work out. 1.7 million is $170. So it sounds like a lot, but it's really not. So when Brooke put her credit card in, uh, the Visa card, yeah, that looks cool. When Brooke put our Visa card in and it came up 1.7 million, I kind of just, uh... Anyway, we're here. We're gonna go for a walk and get a SIM card and I need to get some charcoal tablets because I'm about to smash some Indonesian food and I don't want to be sick. So, honestly, we can't wait. Brooke's just checking out. I'm looking for the mini fridge. Is there a mini fridge? Is there heaps of stuff in it? Uh, empty. empty. I guess I'll have this water. <laughs> All right, that's it for now. We'll um, tune you in when something interesting happens. Good morning. Hello. We are starting our first full day, even though we landed here yesterday morning, but it feels like today's our first full day here. We wake up in bed. We're getting ready because Putu is going to pick us up and take us on an adventure today. I think we're doing water sports. Yeah, there's like these um, kind of like astronaut helmets that are almost like scuba gear, but instead of having like scuba gear on, it's just a helmet and you go under the water. Yeah, so kind of like a different version of snorkeling, I guess. So there's a few things on the list today. So today's going to be packed full of exciting adventures. And some temples. And some temples and some statues. Last night, we just kind of settled in, went for a few walks. 
uh, got a massage really late, had dinner, and just kind of relaxed and just settled in. And now the adventure starts. Our massage for $15 per person. And it was a yeah, good one. Yeah, it was really good. It was only across the road, so it was like super easy. And it put me to sleep pretty quickly. <laughs> so it was definitely a good one. But excited for today's adventure. Yeah. I had a lot of fun with that one. <laughs> Pretty cool. I had two goes at it. It was a bit, bit odd to be honest. Thank you.
you can hold it, no problem. Tie up together. Don't dance and bite. Don't do anything. Okay, man, you can talk to your wrist with your wrist. Yeah. Buddy. And then we do it with your kanba. Okay, my little kanba. Thank you. Haha, he's got your hair clipped. Yeah. He likes it. Is it there? Yeah. Got his banana. A new one, yeah? Yeah. Huge. Looks fake almost. 